Hello everyone, this is my baby girl 888 and today we're playing Factory Balls 3, a Bart Bonte Bonte Bonnet K I don't know how to pronounce the last one game. They can play on coolmath.com, go to the game section, and you can either find it under the logic section or you can find it alphabetically. I was almost done my first recording. And I still had like two balls left because one of the things took me like a minute to do because it was evil and it didn't like me. Now this game, it add, like I have noticed with each new Factory Balls game, they add something, at least one extra thing. In this one, they added a stamp because apparently with ones where you could use red paint if they had red paint, Jack can actually use it. Apparently, the stamp makes the shape di of the nose different. I thought it was interesting. It also has a putty knife to remove paint sometimes. And that's fun. And then there's this one, where they have the different sizes of the dot cover things. And I just kind of think they're creepy. That's just me. This one took me a bit. I messed up on this one a few times. Because it should be really easy, you'd think. Not when you're me, because all you do is that. And for whatever reason, I messed up on it like three times, and I really shouldn't have. That's not the one that messed me up like a billion times. Okay. So this one, we water that once, then we cover it in these, and you water it again, and it's done. Those are easy, and those are fun. This one, you need to chop it twice before you dye it black. Put that on, and that on. Do that, and now you have Pac-Man. Just because I said you had Pac-Man. And I love how it doesn't matter which side you start on. <sighs> so like if you mess up. Well some of them it does matter which side you start on and that really sucks. But this one's like, oh, we have two halves. So it doesn't matter which one you dip it in first as long as you know what you're doing. And if you don't know what you're doing, you're in trouble. And these games really shouldn't be that hard, but sometimes you are sitting there for so long trying to find something out and it's just like oh you didn't find this out yet seriously it's so simple and you're sitting there it's like yeah simple for you I also think that um the thing kinda tilted when I say the thing kinda tilted I mean I just totally messed up I mean like the way the balls go in and are set up I think they're kinda tilted because when you put the hat on it, if you notice the visor is facing up here instead of like down here or over here like it usually does. And uh, I think it's kind of cute. And this one you need to do this with. Take off the mini headset, put on the bigger headphones, dip it back in the black, make it gray. So you have black, white, and gray, and I think that's pretty cool. It looks kind of funky, but it's pretty cool. And then this is just kind of funky too. You just scrape it clean. Makes my balls. Gives them ears. And now it's a white rabbit with orange eyes. It's a deranged rabbit. That's what it is. And it's creepy. And then there's this one where you dip it in blue. Put that on. Dip it in that. Take it off. Do this. Dip it. Do this. Do this. And then you do that. And there you go. I don't know. I just think it's at an angle now. And then what you do is you dip it in red. You chop some. You put that on. You dip it in black. And now you have a smiling Mrs. Pac-Man. Because everyone just, you know, loves that kind of stuff. Like this one, apparently you have to use the stamp. You'd think you'd be able to just use the red. But apparently this makes a different thing when it's not stamped than when it is stamped. Or some complete and utter BS like that. And I seriously do think that the, the, the slants are different. Like for the spray paint. Like, I think it's more at an angle than it was. And, you know, I'm the kind of person who would sit there and ponder this. It's like, didn't it used to look like that? It didn't? Are you sure? I could have sworn. Because, you know, whatever. Okay, so now we're at, like, halfway through, and that's nice. It's always nice when you're, like, halfway through. And then they, like, you see here, the white's a little different than, than everything else. Just me, or Did anyone else notice that between the two games? Oh, it's supposed to be black still, because you're supposed to go like that, and then you dip it in the red. Because once these are out, they can't be colored for whatever reason. I don't understand it, but, you know, 
whatever floats your boat. I should have just dunked the entire thing. Then just done this, dunk it again. There you go, the top's done. Dip it in red, there you go. Do that, do that, dip it again. Do that, do that. Sometimes you're just not thinking when you're doing this stuff. It's like, you really don't need to think. But you're going to think. And you really, really don't need to. Like, I could have just done that right off the bat. Then dipped in blue. Then dipped in that. Then take the glasses off. Make the nose. Ah, uh, you can pop this. I didn't know you could pop it, but apparently, guys, you can pop this. So we're just going to do that now. So that I hopefully don't mess up later. I'm going to mess up later, but now it's not as bad. You dip it in there. Dip it in there. <sighs> this makes it as long as last one did. I don't even know why the last one took so long. Like, I had to get up a few times because of stuff, but it's just like, why did you take so long? You shouldn't have taken so long. And now it's like, did I really make that many mistakes? That's cute. It's like, did I leave it rolling or something? Or, okay, so you know earlier how we had something that looked like this, only minus the ears and with bigger nostril holes? I thought that looked like a pig. And guess what? Now, it is a pig. And it's cute. And it's adorable, because I love pigs. Pigs are my favorite. Not just because I think they're cute, because I think pigs are cute, so get over it. But they also make bacon. I love bacon. Okay, I don't love bacon as much as I did when I was younger. I know everyone who loves bacon is just... Eh, excuse me. Hiccups. Is just sitting there it's like, Ugh, You don't like bacon? It's not that I don't like bacon. It's that I don't like bacon as much as I used to when I was younger. Because of the grease. The grease of the bacon sometimes doesn't agree with me. Because we're going to go into the personal note and talk about bacon and how I didn't agree with me. But, uh, what's it called? I know what it's called. It's called turkey bacon. And I just, I, I really like turkey bacon. Like, it's not, it's obvious top bacon. But it, to me, it's at least not as greasy as bacon. So for me, it's not as, like, unhealthy as bacon. Like, that, that's my little need-to-be-healthier thing. Is, you know, lay off the real bacon and just have this stuff that everyone's just going to sit there, stare at me. It's like, why don't you like real bacon? It's like, well, this is why. I like eating real bacon. It's just the way it's cooked. It depends on how it's cooked. If it's not cooked right, it's like the nastiest stuff on the planet. Because you actually have to do this early. Yep, there we go. And then you can mess up. So what you actually do is you do the stamp first, and then cover it with that stuff, because after you start watering it, it, it kind of stops working. And that stinks. What also stinks is that the... I hate this one so much. This one stinks. It's like the worst thing on the planet. Like, ever. Grass. Then you water it all once, and you cover it. Yeah, then you cover it, cover it in grass again, you water it again, then you cover it in grass again, then you water it again, and I get it the first time this time. Of course, last time it was forever, and I had to stop here because I couldn't flip and get it, because apparently I have troubles with this kind of stuff, which really doesn't surprise, wouldn't surprise me if I did. <sighs> and you leave these on, you scrape it, and then you put this on and you scrape it. Then you put this on and then you dye it blue. That's everything you need to do, right? Oh yes! Last one. And then it's just like, hey, how 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 badly do you think we can take these people off? It's like, oh I think we could do pretty good. I just messed up already. No I didn't. I could have uh stiff in the red. There. You just leave that alone. Mm -hmm. Just do that. Flip it again. Put it back on. Do 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 that. Just 
dunk the whole thing in like 20 times. Okay, let's see if we can do this right. So, dip in the red, put this on, and dip in that, take it off. Then we're gonna flip it, put this back on, dunk it. Then we're gonna flip it, that, dunk it again, again. There we go. Dunk it in red, you dunk it in that, and you take that off. And it's done! There we go! We did everything this time, guys! Then there's Pac Man, he's like, well done, you completed all the levels, congratulations! Woo! Anyways, yeah, I don't, I don't know if there was much commentary in that. If there wasn't much commentary in that, I'm sorry. And I'm wondering why Factory Balls Three took uh, took longer than Factory Balls One and Two combined in one video, but apparently it did. But here's Factory Balls Three. Uh, I believe there's Factory Balls Four, and then I think that is the end of the Factory Ball series minus Factory Balls Christmas, which you can only play on Cool Math. Dot com games cool math hyphen games dot com during Christmas because it's a Christmas game you can only play Christmas games around Christmas Valentine's Day games around Valentine's Day and blah 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 but anyway so yeah that's that uh so I'm leaving uh stay sweet